So we're talking about the WikiLeaks emails about the Clinton inside the Clinton machine. John Podesta, her campaign manager, emails. So just how cozy is Hillary Clinton with Wall Street banks? Well, it's so cozy, it even made her campaign people uncomfortable. That's pretty cozy. It made Hillary Clinton's own campaign people uncomfortable. You, th- you want to know what I'm talking about here? Right here. This is uh, from Robbie Mook, one of her campaign Ah, we've seen Robbie Mook all over there uh, being a talking head surrogate for Hillary Clinton. And this is to John Podesta, the head of her campaign. You know, he, seriously, I just have to say, really, they're using Gmail accounts? She says, I flagged for Tina and Cheryl as well, but it's a little troubling that Goldman Sachs was selected for the foundation event. Huh. Even Robbie Mook, even inside her campaign. So Robbie Mook is talking about a 2014 event where the largest Clinton Foundation donors were holding a meeting at Goldman Sachs. When a Clinton sycophant like Robbie Mook is uncomfortable with Hillary's relationship with Goldman Sachs. (laughs) That's unbelievable. I mean, it's believable, I guess. (laughs) <laughs> I guess that's believable. But it, what's unbelievable is that even her own campaign is like, <laughs> Would you, what's the freaking wrong with her? <laughs> By the way, Chelsea Clinton is married to a hedge fund manager who used to be an executive at Goldman Sachs. Her son-in-law, Hillary's son-in-law, used to be an executive at Goldman Sachs, now is a hedge fund manager. I'm sure over dinner, Hillary tells her son-in-law to cut it out. Cut it out. Do you think all that Wall Street money gives those Wall Streeters access to Hillary Clinton? Well, here's an exchange from one of her Goldman Sachs appearances. When a questioner at a Goldman Sachs said that she raised money for Hillary Clinton in 2008, Hillary Clinton joked, quote, you are the smartest people. Secretary Ann Chow from Houston, Texas. I have had the honor to raise money for you when you were running for president in Texas, Mrs. Clinton. Ms. Clinton. And then she said, you are the smartest people. I think you actually called me on my cell phone, too. I talked to you afterwards. The smartest people. That's why Hillary thinks bankers have all the answers, particularly when it comes to economic crashes, their own greed created. Their answer is for the taxpayers to give them mountains of cash, and both Democrats and Republicans agree. Isn't that weird? So what does all this public and private policy stuff add up to? Well, the campaign has always been cleaning, been cleaning up after Hillary. For instance, here we go. Right here it says... Team, attached are the flags from HRC's paid speeches we have from HWA. I put some highlights below. There is a lot of policy positions that we should give an extra scrub with policy. In terms of what was opened to the press and what was not, the Washington Examiner got a hold of one of the private speech contracts. Her speeches to universities were typically open press. So this is worth a read. An extra scrub. Did you hear that? Give her give the stuff. Give it an extra scrub. What does that mean? Well, if you're a politician of principle, you don't need to be scrubbing after your policy all the time. So that's what that means. So when it comes to the Wall Street, the Clintons are really cleaning up. For instance, Here's uh, Hillary noted that pres- that President Clinton had spoken at the same Goldman Sachs summit last year, and Lloyd Blankfein joked, "Ha ha, he increased our budget." So Lloyd Blankfein jokes to Hillary, "Ah, he increased our budget," meaning the speaking fee budget. So here's what she says. Some of you might have been here last year, and my husband was, I guess, in this very same position. And he came back and was just thrilled by 
Mr. Blankfein. He was just thrilled by. And then Lloyd Blankfein jumps in and says, he increased our budget. And then Secretary Clinton says, did he? I think he encouraged you to grow a little too. The increased budget is Goldman Sachs speaking fee budget. Hillary knowingly answers that they get good return for their investment. That money not only buys you access, but you get privileged classified information as a cherry on top. You ready? Because here's what she revealed. She's talking about Osama bin Laden and how they nailed him. And in this speech, she reveals that Osama bin Laden was discovered by a phone intercept and not by ground data. She just tells them this. Clinton spokesman Brian Fallon is yelling that these email hacks are from Russia, and that's why we should look away and ignore them. He's accusing the media of digging through the hacks just like Russia wants. Isn't it awful that the Russians made our political system so sleazy and corrupt? There's more. <laughs> 